Time. It's, it basically it says, and it say a uh, name, man. All right, but let the Lord be true and every man a liar. Okay, it says, um, for all the unfaithful shall die in their faithfulness. Behold, saith the Lord, I will be praised upon the world, the sword, famine, death, and destruction. For wickedness has exceedingly polluted the whole earth, and their hopeful works are fulfilled. It says, therefore, saith the Lord, I will, I, will, I will hold my tongue no more as touching their wickedness, which they profanely commit. Right, because it's that time in that Psalms 50, it says he kept silence. He allowed the wicked to do what they do because he's given them their time. And then after their time is, you know, fulfilled, that's when he comes with that second death. But go ahead. Neither will I suffer them in those things in which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood cried unto me, and the soul of the just complain continually. Uh -huh. It says, And therefore said the Lord, I will surely avenge them and receive them unto me all the innocent blood from among them. Behold, my people is led as a flock to the slaughter. I will not suffer them now to dwell in the land of Egypt. You pause right. right there. It's a lot. It, 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 I'm listening to that, and it just made me think, like, you know, all the traps that they set for us. Like, I watched the video, and I reposted that video, uh, the shop they did. You might want to speak on it. You know, you're, you're, where you at, shop? Shop here. Shop here. Shop here. But uh, he, he did a video which was talking about the, uh, the uh, how they just legalized cocaine. But yet, you got thousands of Thousands upon thousands, if not millions, of jail, right? Oh, yeah. People oh, that are still locked up over over cocaine charges, going back to the eighties, mm -hmm. right? Right? These guys are still locked up, but now, you know, they want to legalize it. it, it this is, you know, and it, it's it's an outright slap in the face, man. It's outrageous, man. So, real quick, and we are gonna get come back to that. We get uh, Isaiah forty two and twenty two, and then y'all stop me if you wanna add up to that because you just did that last. Said enough. That was all that needed to be said. Got it. Got it. Hmm. Get that Isaiah real quick. Isaiah chapter 42 and verse 22. But this is a people robbed and spoiled. They are all of them snared in holes, and they are hid in prison houses. They are for prey and none delivered. So after you demonize shame and ruin the lives of, of, of so many young, you know, especially especially uh, uh, Southern and Northern Kingdom, both, both over that over that crack. You know, over, over the code, because crack was, is, uh, was designed in a damn laboratory. Uh, you know, that wasn't, you know, cocaine didn't come like that. Hey, I watched that, that movie uh, last week, The Cocaine Bear. And they, they were pretty much just showing you how, you know, it was eating much that was just bringing that, that uh, allowing it to come in. And they were dumping it mainly right into the hood, man. All right? And then they sell up policies, you know, to railroad jet straight to prison, man. So, he, so if you if, so if you just survive the drug wars, I mean that crack, you know, it even changed the gangbang game <coughs> in Chicago. Right. It, it broke up the the, the, the five and the six. They, everything got weird after that, you know. And and it just made made more and more death. Because these people, you know, and made so made that death come upon them this very night. Right. 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 Talks about this uh, verse 11. So this, this is 2nd Ezra chapter 15, now verse 11. But I will bring them with a mighty hand and a stretch out arm and smite Egypt with plagues as before. Mm. See, as he did in ancient Egypt, mm. all right, and, and caused those plagues that he put upon <coughs> those Egyptians, all right. Well, Esau, Edom, America is the modern day Egyptians, you see, and so he's going to smite. Egypt with plagues as before, as the elder was saying about these different uh, uh, things, and it's just going to continue to heighten, and more and more plagues and pestilence is going to hit this place, and we want the uh, blood on our doorposts. We want that that faith in the word of God, you know, and that is going to defend us in that day. Well, yeah. see, yeah, it's like an ancient Egypt. That's it. He said, I will suffer the land of Goshen in that day. Who was born in the land of Goshen? Right. That yeah, was us, man. That's it. So while it was three days of darkness and they was bugging out, we was, we was cool, man. We had a great life, like the scripture says, man. That's it. You know? And instead said, uh, when, you read, when you see parts of the signs pass, then you should know this is the time the Lord is coming to visit. And we got not only parts, but we got a whole bunch of parts. Yeah. <laughs> the parts are not. <laughs> they're moving and, they're moving and shaking and gyrating. 
I mean, if you can't see it's the end of time right now, you are you can see the one. That's right. Yeah, even he can see it. <laughs> 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 And it says, but I will bring them with a mighty hand and a short short arm and smite Egypt with plagues as before, and I will destroy all the land thereof. Egypt shall mourn, and the foundation shall be smitten with plagues and punishment that Yahweh shall shall bring upon it. Right. One of those plagues is, is, is uh, homelessness. That's right. Another one, not, and now you you got uh, a whole plague of uh, these, these these women, and the black woman is affected the most, the so-called black woman. Um, that, are, that are actually homeless and sitting in their cars because a lot of them are right now. Right. Right. Perfect. And they're talking about things yeah. like they're doing. So a lot of them are losing. But you know, that alignment that they had with the enemy, all the goodies, Esau's turning them. Now we were having that discussion on the way here. Esau is now, he's now turning on Eve. That's right. The same way he turned on Ammon and Moab, yeah. you know, the way he turned on Ham, all those nations that helped Esau uh, come into power, he turned on them all. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know? And subjugated them. All right, made them desolate. And now his kingdom is becoming desolate. That's right. The Lord is sending those plagues on his, on his red ass. Mm -hmm. All right? And, and, and what are we to do while the plagues are running rapid in this place, man? So what's going back to the example of Egypt? What did the Lord tell us? Be still and see the salvation of your God, man. That's all we have to do, man. That's apply what he told us to do. You know what I mean? And let that be our hope, man. All right? Because if we have hope, in this present evil world, then your hope is vain. That's right. See, That's right. we got a hope in the salvation of Yahweh Shem Shah and the word of God coming to pass. All right? And that's going to come to pass. Our hope is sure, uh, sure and steadfast. You see? Because uh, the Most High is not a man that he should lie. And everything that he said that was going to come to pass up until the time that we're speaking right now and you listening, it didn't happen. So everything else is about to happen too. What you got, brother? Yeah, uh, Sirach chapter 34, verse 1. The hopes of a, of a man void understanding are in vain and false and dreams live of fools. That's it. it. It's vain because only the word of God is going to come to pass, man. And the word of God said that it's going to, uh, uh, yeah, this is going to uh, accomplish where he's at, right? And, and the ultimate will is the kingdom of heaven. So if the kingdom of heaven is going to be established, well, then that's the destruction of this place, right? And you're going to have the prophets out to uh, uh, chant down this uh, the downfall. Yeah, well, it says uh, he didn't have a dream, let him tell a dream, man. And what have these people been living, man? What is called the American dream, man. And you got to be, what, sleep to, to, to believe it. Now you got to wake up. That's right. Now you got to wake up. And Scripture says those that look out the windows be darkened, man. They're not seeing no hope in this place. That, that's right. it. That, that, yeah, that, it's that, a nightmare now. Yeah. Yep. That Thessalonians 5 going in, that, that's what it talks about being sleep. He said, but we not sleep as do others, right? Because right? we children of the light. Right, and knowing that our Lord and Savior is coming. All right? And he's coming like that thief in the night. But it says, but ye brethren are not in darkness that, that they should overtake you as a thief. All right? That's knowing what time it is. Mm-hmm. That's right, brother. Yeah. This uh Jeremiah chapter 32, verse 42. For thus said the Lord, like as I have brought all this great evil upon this people. So will I bring upon them all the good that I have promised them. Mm. That's it. Hey, it, 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 we went. We went through the lower state, and we we hey, we still can't go no lower. That's it. Can't go no lower. We taking dirt caps. That's it. And, 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 you know, in the Lord, those of us who die in this truth, man, we be the first race up. I don't believe that. That's God. 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 All right. What you got, brother? Uh, this is Jeremiah three and twenty-two. <clears throat> Return ye backsliding children, and I will heal your backsliding. Behold, come unto thee, for thou art the Lord Yahweh our power. Truly in vain is salvation hope from the hills and from the multitude of mountains. Surely in the Lord Yahweh our power is the salvation of Israel. That's it. You got all these different uh, um, nations and the governments of those nations and the mindsets that they have. It's all going to be conquered. You had something, bitch? Oh. Yeah, and all they lies, man. Uh, that was a book that I talked about the line yesterday. By, what was his name? E.J. Emerson? Did you pull that up again? Yep. Pull that up, brother. And, I mean, 
you know, just, just thinking about what the brother just said about the, their, their hope is vain. This dude wrote a book about saying that he saw he was the two main characters in the Bible. But then he wrote the book, and he basically, in the book, he's saying that yeah, he was spirit to Jacob and Esau. But he, no, he wrote it. He said Esau and Jacob. And it, yeah, that's where he wrote it. Okay. But he said you can either be spiritual Esau or you can, or you can be spiritual Jacob. <laughs> so he tried. So, trying to find so, he, did, so you're talking about, you know, replacement theory to the, to the max, man. Right. And, and then I'm, li I'm reading this, man, and I'm like, who the hell would choose to be spiritual Esau? Right. <laughs> who would choose that? <laughs> you know, madness, man. <laughs> but anyway, you got that book? What's the name of the book, Eric? Uh, um, the work. The work. The work. You got it. You got it right. Yeah, the brother, it was, it was, uh, I think it was, it was I forget the name. It's, uh, it's, it's titled Jacob or Esau, Which Brother Are You? by H.J. Emerson. Mm -hmm. Good. Could you read that little, that little portion there that really kind of breaks it down? But it's just going to show you. It's madness, man. These people, they're, they're hoping and, and, and just complete vanity and this stuff that is, there is no profit. It says, a study of spiritual Israel and, and spiritual Edom of the end days through the type and anti-type of Jacob and Esau in the Genesis account. So basically, you know, it's replacement doc doctrine to, to the max because now you can be you now you can be spiritual Edom. So what he's saying is that you know there is no more Edom and there is no more there, there is no more uh, Jacob. So then, what's the whole book about then? Right. All right. Because you because look, the Lord is about to, just like in this Passover, the Lord is returning to a world. That is ruled by Esau. Point blank period. They're the last. They're the last. Right? Jacob is, is, is the uh, is the beginning of, of, of that one, the next one that follows. You know the story. Somebody yeah. grab it. So come to my I got a free stuff for you so much. Go ahead, bro. This is Psalms 14 and um, 7. Oh, that the salvation of Israel will come out of Zion when the Lord bringeth back the captivity of his people. Mm. Jacob shall rejoice and Israel shall be glad. So the, the, the first level of salvation is Israel being delivered out of captivity, point blank period. All right, Jeremiah uh, 17 and 4. We was going to be put in slavery, lose our heritage. We was going to be sold to our enemies. All right, Jeremiah 5, 19. But the brother Shekhar read, to receive this evil, we're also going to receive the good. That's right. All right, that's the whole purpose of the, the book of the prophets and the prophets coming back now. It's the purpose of us getting our land back, man. And along with our land, this time the Lord's going to give us the new covenant. So we can keep our land, so we ain't got to lose it, man. Right. That's the salvation. Second Corinthians 9 literally says it. And we can grab that. Yeah, what, you know, what about the parable of the wheat and the tares? All right? The reward to Jacob and the punishment to, to the tares? I mean, mm -hmm. madness, man. Come. Give us the, the other action box. Well, Second action, man. I'm right. Nine what? Uh, uh, this is uh second Edges chapter uh nine verse eight it says uh i'll start at uh verse seven and everyone that shall be saved and shall be able to escape by his works and by faith whereby ye have believed. Which precepts, right? With James, it talks about faith without works of the hands. Well, who does James start off reading to? To the 12 tribes of Israel, greedy, scattered abroad, greedy. That's the Gentiles that Paul uh, reached out to, the scattered Israelites. Go ahead. Verse 8, it says, shall be preserved from the said perils and see my salvation in my land and within my borders, for I have sanctified them for me from the beginning. That's salvation. Israel uh, escaping the hell to come upon this place. As how Shai said, Luke 21, uh, uh, stay upon your watch and pray always that you escape the things that come upon this earth. All right, so that's the one step of salvation is escaping the hell. But then escaping the hell comes of what? Being New Jerusalem, coming down out of the chariots and getting our land back, man. That's salvation, man. Ain't no spiritual Jacob, spiritual Esau. <laughs> Not the way they put it, man. And then another uh, uh, form of salvation is what uh, the Apostle Paul said in that he said, who shall deliver me from the body of this death? Yeah. You see, and the Israelites are the only ones that's promised to be in bodies that's not susceptible to sin. Right. Exactly. So, right. the, so, the, so the spiritual Israelites going to get that? 
Right. So the spiritual, the spiritual Jacobs, I mean the spiritual Edomites, uh, <laughs> got to go into slavery. And they ain't even enslaved Jacob. Right. That, I mean, and, it, this is madness. And, and so even when they uh, uh, use a, a particular scripture um, about spiritual Israel. Really, that's for Israelites to be spiritual and not carnal. Yeah, because exactly. a lot of our people were just being carnal. And so they were like, nah, you know, it don't matter what you're doing on the, the you know, uh, 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 outside because you could be doing all kind of heathenistic stuff and now you're not counted as Israel. Exactly. Exactly. When it is a Jew, must be a Jew inwardly. That's right. being spiritual. You got to be spiritual. That's why the Lord said it. But those that worship me must worship me in spirit and in truth. Now, that's being spiritual. You can, you can be brew walking with your bridges on. Right. And, right. I mean, that's turning. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, but a, lot of these, a lot of these, uh, these friends wearing guys, especially them, them t shirt friends type people, you know, they all about marketing. Because uh, typically, you know, and, I, and I've always had my, you know, the, I always had a distrust in those guys that everything's about selling a t-shirt and brand name, so, you know, and then now, and then it dawned on me, you know, in order to get people to, 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 uh, to buy yourself, you got to get them to watch you, so you got to come up with outlandish tactics to get, draw attention to yourself, right, exactly. so that they can buy your hats, what the man is not supposed to be prophesying with his head, right, the crowd's supposed to be exposed, you know, hey, hey, being spiritual is knowing that hey, all we got to do is teach the word directly and correctly. We don't need no type of uh, gimmicks, no type of thrills, this, that, and the other thing. It says we are laborers together with God. And so we trust that Yahweh Shai is going to do what they said they was going to do. And we do our part and we just teach the word and live the word to the best of our ability, man. Yeah, and, 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 and also uh, with that uh, replacement theology, man, hey, the Lord made a promise to Abraham, man. You're not cutting that off, bro. That's right. right. You got it right here? I got you right you here. You got it? Go ahead. This is the book of Luke 1. I'm going to start at 68. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, Woo! for he hath visited and redeemed his people. Yeah. Perfect. And hath raised up and poured a salvation for us. In the house of his servant David. And it also says uh, in the book of Psalms, the Lord said, I'm not going to lie to David, man. He says, uh, his seed will endure forever, man. Hey, and, and scripture as, also, as, as the son before him. As the son before him. The scripture says, if you can do away with these ordinances, right. the sun, the moon, the stars, and all that, right. then I will brother call God, for brother, God, God. God. Don't read it, brother. Uh, 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 it's uh, <laughs> Jeremiah 31 and 35. Thus saith Yahweh, which giveth the sun for a light by day, and the ordinances of the moon and of the stars for a light by night, which divided the sea when the waves there there are. Yahweh of hosts is his name. If those ordinances depart from before me, saith Yahweh, then the seed of Israel also shall cease from being a nation before me forever. Thus said Yahweh, if heaven above can be measured, and the foundations of the earth search out beneath, I will also cast off all the seed of Israel for all that they have done. And all those ordinances are still there. All those ordinances are still there, and they cannot measure. What's the scripture? It's like he stretched out the curtain. Somebody grab that. Uh, because, then, you know, there was a, uh, a NASA scientist that talked about how. It, it, it looks like it's when they're looking through their the telescopes, it's like the, the heavens are still growing. Mm -hmm. they, they always find a new constellation, a new star, a new something. It's like, well, that wasn't there before. Well, that will come. Absolutely. It's the book of Genesis 8 and 22. While the earth remaineth, and it says in Ecclesiastes, the first chapter, how the earth abideth forever, by the way. It says, while the earth remaineth, seed time and harvest, and cold and heat, and summer and winter and day and night shall not cease. Mm -hmm. So what the brother read in Jeremiah, man, those are, 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 are for, uh, perpetual ordinances. Uh, hey, you want to go back to that? <coughs> yeah, 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 I'll go back to Luke. Uh, can I speak on one thing? It, and he said, uh, the, the seed, right? <coughs> so technically to be a spiritual Israelite, you got to be of the seed anyway. That's right? it. You have the spirit of the life. Exactly. So, yeah, you may look like a more, but you know, something of another nation. Because y'all want to put that twist on it, but hey, technically, yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. You got to have the spirit and be of the bloodline of uh, uh, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. That's right. the covenant. And more importantly, 
It's if you got the elect or not. That's right. If you That's are right. of the elect or not. That's right. Which if you are of the elect, you got the truth. And it says uh, there's no end to all the people. You're not cutting off this bloodline. We still uh, here. That's right. We still here. Go so, ahead, yeah, man. It's back uh, in Luke 1, verse 70. As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets, which have been since the world began, that we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate and, us. And that was the whole thing the whole time. It says since the world began, the prophets was speaking of the redemption yeah. and the salvation of the chosen children of the Most High God. That's the gospel. Yeah. That the, 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 the righteous chosen children are being purified and perfected to uh, 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 rule the eternal righteous kingdom. But before honor is humility. And we had to go through this straight gate, this present evil world, where we even trapped in this, these chains of darkness. It was all for our learning, you see. But we're ultimately going to be saved from this to rule the eternal righteous kingdom. That's the gospel. That's, that's right. Isaiah 61. That's the good news yeah. that righteousness is going to reign supreme yeah. forever and not wickedness. To appoint joy to all those that mourn in Zion. <laughs> that, I, that 61st chapter tells you what the gospel is for. Literally. Matter of fact, can I, can I add this? Oh, Absolutely. The, the, I'm, I'm, in, I'm in this fantastic Bible. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm reading this, this in the second book of Moses and Exodus. And, you know, being that Exodus, you know, the 12th chapter. On the table, that's what's going on tonight, you know, and that how that's this is the ordinance to be kept forever. Then, how where's the spiritual stuff at? If you get order, why would you keep an ordinance for somebody that's not even a, the people that it was intended for? Exactly. But, uh, but I'm gonna read uh, second Edwards real quick, the first chapter, uh, verses one through five, and it says, It says, Oh, <coughs> how there are uh, uh, my names of the children of Israel came to Egypt, every man in his household came with Jacob, Reuben, Simeon, Levi, and Judah, Issachar, Zebulon, Benjamin, Dan, Natali, Gad, and Asher. So all the souls that came out of the loins of Isaac were 70 souls. Joseph was in Egypt already. Man, you can't, this is a bloodline, man. This, this is a family. This is a race of people That's it. that were created to be special with the Lord, man. That's it. All right? And they were in captivity in, 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 in Egypt, and they were being oppressed, all right, and mistreated, and the Lord heard their cries, and he sent this death angel, and, that, that, and matter of fact, that, that was Yahweh Shah. He right. is the Grim Reaper, That's right. all right? Uh, and the Grim Reaper is going to come get the, this, this promised people, the elect, the few chosen few. Out of Egypt again. That's yeah. right. 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 And, and um, that's why there's a, a pyramid on the back of the dollar bill. And so many uh, 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 places in America that have these cities and towns and places that have Egyptian names. That's, that's right. right. <coughs> Just laying back on, uh, on the Yaakov, it's the point of the gospel. This is the book of Acts, chapter 1, verse 6. It says, When they therefore were come together, how shy will thou at this time restore again the kingdom to Israel? And that's the point. That's it. Yep, he said, will thou, because our Lord. To the spirituals. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so our Lord had just been crucified and then uh, raised up, right? And then came and sucked with the apostles. The disciples turned to apostles. And they knew. They was like, hey, <laughs> you about here, is, it, is it at this time you're about to restore rulership of the earth back to Israel? And look, when you read the scriptures, that's the clear that's the clear mindset all of them had. That's Even it. The, wicked, the wicked trials and Pharisees. Yep. They said that the Messiah was to come and take down Rome. That's what they thought. They thought he was going to come in his top. They thought he was going to come in his majesty right. and come take down Rome. So when he came lowly on an ass, they didn't believe who he was. Right. Uh -huh. But that was the whole, that was the that was the mentality of the nation. Right. We all was looking for a savior to deliver us from the hands of our enemies. And they was looking for the conquering lion. The lion came out of the wood. That's it. So he, it, this time he's coming as that conquering lion right. to conquer all mindsets. 
You know, that's contrary to the mindset of Yahweh Shem Shaka. That's right. And all mindsets of this world, indeed, is contrary to the mind of Yahweh Shem Shaka. So he's coming to conquer all that. And if you have any of the mindsets of this world that's going to be conquered, well, then you're not going to be saved. Mm -hmm. Well, it says, uh, unto, him, and, and it says uh, unto him, unto Shiloh shall the gathering of the people be, man. Which cuts a lot of guys who are saying, because I remember first coming in, man, I was dealing with the, you know, the ISUBK, man. You know, and they were saying, oh, we all, everybody got to come under uh, General Rihanna. Everybody got to come under What's General Rihanna. What scripture is that? Yeah, right. But, but, but it says, but it says uh, uh, that I come to bring division, man. The Lord is, is, is causing division. We're not going to, uh, only people that's going to, and I said this uh, the other day, man. There's only one people on the earth right now that are 100% agreeance, and that is the elect. Okay? Everybody else are having arguments. They're uh, Egyptian against Egyptian, even the elites, man. They're, they're, they're not agreeing, man. The Lord is checking that shit up. That's right. Yeah. You still got people out here, them, them, them young people. They all on the comic board. And, and, and especially on the TikTok, got an extra set of demons. Oh, you know, it's like them, them demons on TikTok. Is up. And on YouTube, man. Super demons. Come on. Come on. It's on YouTube, man. Them demons on. And, and, and it's a whole lot of them, them, them yacht. You know, I, all I see is guys with hats on, with, yeah. with, with hair down past their shoulders. You know, and you already know the Old Testament only. Israel. You know, Israel. Yeah, them, 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 them yes, we're like we yakma, bringing it all, bringing bring all that confusion, man. All right, the Lord is not the author of confusion. So, the Rawat Kodesh. Right. Oh, Rawat. All right, and then, and then a lot of them also are women. The Kohen. These women, these women are constantly, you know, having a, a having a, having a voice. And often they're wrong, man. Look, if you if you're a woman, all right, and you believe on your how about Chanel shot, you know, be quiet. And then if you say like Shalom, brothers, Shalom, prophets, or you know, something that's uplifting, don't don't be trying to throw in your two cents and your scriptures and nothing. Don't, don't do that. That's right. That's not your job. That's that's the whole thing. For us, we're, we're trying to reestablish the order that the Lord set up. Stop trying to, you know. War, you know what I'm saying, and throw little uh, spears and daggers and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Because again, the men, this is a, a war, you know? And so, no, y'all don't come in with, you know, you know, oh, I'm coming to, you know, stab somebody. Yeah, yeah. Watch the warrior king. <laughs> <laughs> right. And, and, and it's funny, too, that you mentioned that. That hit, that hit me that Netflix about maybe not even a week ago, and it was number one. It's already moved out. It's not even in the top ten anymore. Nobody, <laughs> nobody's watching that shit. I watched the movie. It was nothing but movie because they first dropped. But then, next thing you know, like two, three days later, it was in number ten. But now it's not even in the top ten. So, you know, nobody watching that shit. Bring up the brother. He's even on this one. Let's go. Acts chapter 3, verse 13. It says, Repent ye therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out. For the times of repression shall come from the presence of the Lord. And he shall send Yahweh Shahmashiach, which before was preached unto you, whom the heaven must receive unto the times of restitution of all things, which the Most High has spoken by the mouth of his holy prophets since the world began. For Moses truly said unto the fathers, A prophet shall the Lord your God raise up unto you of your brethren, like unto me. Him shall ye hear in all things whatsoever he shall say unto you. That's it. And that's Yahweh Shah, man. And he's coming to get, just like it says uh, in that Matthew 1 and 21, how that he's coming to save his people. That's right. And just right. like that Luke, you know, uh, chapter 1 that uh, uh, the elder bro Mathaki was reading, you know, man, same, same thing. I'm coming to redeem Israel and restore Israel back into power and this time they're going to be in their right mind because they would have been purified and perfected by the straight gate of this present evil world. He said, uh, I will not give my glory to another. Right. So how's he going to give uh, his own people to the spiritual to, to the spiritual one who's, to, who's actually responsible for killing Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai Bashem and his people all the day long. The perpetual hatred of uh, uh, the uh, us on hanging back next on the willow trees, but then you, now you get a chance to be 
glorified now in the kingdom too? Just, just, a, just a good, I'm sorry, Lord, I believe now. Mm -hmm. That's what the Lord has been whipping our ass and putting us through the ringer. Right, right. Uh, I have Wait, bring out the God you bring. Yeah, so we have some, uh, uh, Psalms 132, verse 10 down to 18. It said, For thy servant David's sake, turn not away the face of thy anointed. Yahweh has sworn in truth unto David, he will not turn from it. Of the fruit of thy body will I set upon the throne of Yahweh. Mm. Okay. Of the of thy body. body. So that ain't got nothing to do with no spiritual nothing. Yeah, it said, If thy children would keep my covenant and my testimony, that I should teach them, their children shall also sit upon the throne forevermore. For Yahweh had chosen Zion, he had desired for his habitation. Mm. Where's, where's this all in that? Right, it said, This is my rest forever. That's what, <coughs> what? This is my rest forever. This is where I put my, my bed. This is where I put my, 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 my ass at. This, this is where I put my head at. This is where I rest and relax at. My yeah. habitation. That's my habitation. My yeah. habitat. Oh, if, if here while I dwell, for I have desired it. I will abundantly bless her provision who will satisfy her horrible bread and it will be possible. Alright, it says uh, I will also clothe her priests with salvation and her saints shall shout aloud for joy. Uh, and the park is uh, he's pointing one one lily, one flower, uh, one flower, one land, he said one pit. Yep. He said he said I got one pit, he said I got uh United uh, pits of, of the Heavenly Father. Yeah, it's, it's, it's one one pit. And that's Israel. Man. Read again. I will, verse sixteen. I will also call her priests, which is a uh, 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 possessive noun. Her priests with salvation. It don't say any other nation. It said, and her saints shall shout aloud for joy. There I will make the horn of David. Uh, the saints are everyone. That's who the saints are. Yeah. 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 It said, there will make the horn of David to bud. I have ordered a lamp for my anointed. His enemies will I clothe with shame, but upon himself shall his crown forge. I got that scripture if you want. This is uh, 2nd Edges chapter 5, verse 26. Uh, it says, And of all the fowls that are created, thou hast named thee one dove. And of all the cattle that are made, thou hast provided thee one sheep. And among all the multitudes of people. So you got the, you got the Chinese, you got the Japanese, you got the everybody else, right? Right. Among all the multitudes of people, thou hast gotten thee one people. So he said, I have one chosen people. One group that, that is, these are my folks. Mm -hmm. Right. <clears throat> and unto this people. Yeah, that's, like the, that's like the rest of the birds, bad as hell. That's why I'm gonna walk up and be like, you chose this dove? <laughs> right. Because it said out of all the birds, one dove. That's it. Out of right. all the cattle, one lamb. So this is the Lord bearing it down the favors, the favorites out of his own creation. Man. Right. Yeah. You know? And he can that he has the right to have. Yeah, right. Like other birds can <laughs> He can play that why I can fly the highest and the hawks say I'm the fastest. Why you can be right. Well, this defense looked up. It already makes me kind of make sense, man. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Learned, man. That's but it. Really, don't have no defense. That's right. That's because our only defense <coughs> is the Yahweh. And that's all. Hey, that's that's all it. It. and that's all we got. That's all we need. That's and they yeah. try to. It's funny because they try to shame men now for having preference. Uh, as far as like women, you know what I mean? Like they, you know, they, they, they like it women. I don't like big women, or I don't like this type of woman. Hey, hey, no, I say the truth. We don't like black. This is Acts 5 and 31. He'll have the most high power of God exalted with his white will to be the prince and the savior. But to give repentance to Israel and forgive them their sins. Like y'all said, this ain't no spiritual thing. The only people who are going to get delivered is the Israelites. Right. All these other people are going to get judged, and, and two thirds are going to be judged, and these other nations are going to be on our fucking feet. That's we're right. Put our foot on their fucking head. Like they said in Isaiah 49, they're going to bow down to us with their face toward the earth and look up the dust of our feet. Because that, that's, that's judgment, and they got to pay for that. You know, this has to come to pass, rather nobody like it or not. This is the true gospel, and this is the uh, truth. 
the truth is going to always flourish, like it says in um, Second Edward six, that the um that the, the truth that has not been so long with fruit is now being um, shot upon. It's not being shown. So now the truth is here, and there's nothing they can do about it to stop this because the how about you out shot is ordering this and sending his men to teach this. To push this from to eternity until we get the hell up out of here. That's it. All right, yeah. what? Kind of, kind of. Uh, this kind is Psalm 147, 19 and 20. He showed his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. And that's the word of God. That's Yahweh Shah. That's his righteousness. That's everything, right? Right. And he only showed it unto Israel, right? right. What did it say next? He has not. Dealt so with any nation. You see, he has not dealt so with any nation. And as far and as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye Yahweh. This is only for the Israelites, man. You have to get right behind it. This is uh, Revelation chapter 2 <coughs> and 25. It says, But that which ye have already, hold fast till I come. What do you have? This word. That's right. It says, And he that overcometh and keepeth my word. Work unto the end, which is only given to the Israelites. Okay. Right? That's to right. him will I give power over the nations. That's right. Oh, that's how you If it's spiritual, how are you going to have an Edomite, a, a damn Moabite, all the kingdom rule over different. They really want to push power. power over. It's over. 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 And it's, you know, it's like, you know, you know, like, you know, work the night clubs you know, and, and you have a guest list. Right, right. People come up, you know, and it's like they, they try, try to try to get in. in. Right. Well, I know so and so, I know, know so and so. I'm like, that's good because other people don't. Do. <laughs> <laughs> Are you on the list? <laughs> and, and <it's> like, <laughs> you're not on the list. That's it. <laughs> if I may, could, could you read that again, brother? Because it talks about how in that Colossians that when we were, it says we Israelites were enemies in our mind by wicked works. When we had the works of the heathen, because we have our own works that we should produce. You see, the works of righteousness. All right. So read that again, brothers. Revelation chapter two, verse twenty-six. Uh huh. And he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end. You see, that keepeth my works unto the end. All right. The works of the Most High God. He said it was his ways that was higher than your ways. His thoughts that was higher than your thoughts. Right. And he gave us those ways. To produce righteousness. It's because you have a lot of people that <laughs> lean to their own understanding and establish their own righteousness. That's what the heathen do. It says that, you know, every yeah, way. Yeah, doing it too. Yeah. They, yeah. They, you know, some of these other, uh, other some of these hat wearing camps, you know, these, these Christ worshiping camps. Uh, that are horrible. You got yeah. Jake doing that too, man. They need to their own understanding. That's right? it. Talking something. And, you know, there's no precepts to back up what they're saying. That's or it. Or they're trying to twist things and make it say something that they don't say. That's it. That's in it. that Proverbs, it says every way of man is right in his own eyes. Right. You see? But what's truly right, what's truly righteous is the works of of the Most High God. That's right. And that is the works that we must be producing when our Lord and Savior comes. If you're producing any other mindset and the works that stem from those mindsets, well, then that's wicked works. You see? And looking like a fool. Exactly. Because you're not doing, you, you're looking like my man said, no, I'm going to get you sucked up with his stats. Right? He's got his hat. Right, right, right. right. Oh, yeah, in, his mind, yeah, yeah, yeah. in his mind, and, and that dude knows the kingdom, you know, he's a Dominican. Right. But what, 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 uh, oh, he was cool. Mind, he was the, the smooth. Man, my man was coming down the street. Yeah. Oh, of the man. Man. year. Oh, 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 right. Yeah. You couldn't tell him nothing. Oh, yeah, they were going to have a big fish stack. Yeah. Fish stack. Yeah. 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 Hey, look, they don't want to listen, but bring out what you got. You call it. This is uh, Jeremiah chapter 23, verse 7. Therefore, behold, the days come, saith the Lord, that they shall no more say, The Lord Yahweh liveth, which brought up the children of Israel out of the land of Egypt. But the Lord Yahweh by Shemiah was shot, liveth, which brought up and which led the seed of the house Ooh. of Israel oh. out of the north country. They hate that word. They hate that word. That's right. They hate that word. Seed. Now that he just said seed, I want you to hold that. Perfect. I, I watched, uh, we were on the way here, I was watching a video with, uh, and they were, they were, they were praising uh, uh, Rihanna. <laughs> oh, this queen, this goddess. And I guess it was, because I, I didn't watch the, uh, the Super Bowl halftime. And that was the scene when she was on the stage. She's pregnant. Right. right, in pants. 
and you had like they looked like maybe about a, a whole group of guys that were all wearing white that were crawling, and all the women were on there, and the and the and the, and the, 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 uh, the little mean thing, whatever you want to call it, said the hashtag all my exes, and it showed all these men crawling, wow. and they all in white, and then one of them get up and start gyrating. I'm like, so I'm like, so then I looked at it, and I'm like, well, damn. All those are all, all those dudes in the white, those are all the different firm samples. That's right. All right, right. And, and all the women on the comment board that, that that's co-signing it, because all of them are like 100, oh, that was me. Yeah, me too. <laughs> so so basically, these women in Babylon is worse than mindset. It is not okay to, to, to I'm looking at a, a, a sea of men for one woman to have had that many men. That's right. And then was, put the camera pan around the room. All right? And then you still you want to talk about yah yah quah and all this other stuff. You didn't you didn't you didn't lay with this many men. And some, all right, and then some. And then some. And we're not gonna talk about the two the, the right, whole right. time the, the uh, three times in college when you went to uh, uh, to to, to right. uh, what do they call it down there? Back in the day when they used to go to Freak, Freak Nick in Atlanta. All right, you went down to Freak Nick in Atlanta. You know, and you played with 30 guys, and you did that two or three years in a row. Hey, the brother said the Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras. Oh, yeah, the beats, right. You walk around the rest out, and all the beats. Yep. Yeah, like I said, women too. Yep. Women too, man. Yeah. 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 One bitch said she had uh, 500 bodies. I be fucking niggas and I be fucking bitches. Oh, shit. It was a woman that had two thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand. She said two thousand bodies. Oh, yeah. She, 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 she said, what do you count? She said, what do you count? Men or women? Oh, yeah. Man, you know, this is little girl. So she got all kind of demons on her. Oh, all kinds. And you can't, you can't, you can't celebrate it. That kind of wickedness, man. We live in a society where that woman is high five. Right. 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 She, 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 you know, she's a boss bitch. Right. right. You know? That's why I was the so The Lord is not coming back for no, yep. no, for a boss bitch. That's right. right. No boss bitch is going to get on the chariot. That's no right. boss bitch is going to be an Isaiah form one woman getting the covering of a man of the Lord. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. You know what's gonna happen? She gonna then burn. You gonna you gonna have to, some some of these women are gonna fall victim of their own devices, and they're gonna have to be with this many men. Except this time, it's not gonna be by choice. That's right. 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 So go out and let them fall to their own devices, man. You Carousel gonna ride you this time, huh? That's right. That's right. You put me on that movie, The Divide. I was actually kind of traumatized by that shit. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, kind of, I'm, I'm kind of squeamish. So that's a deep movie, like that. man. Hey, but. <laughs> they 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 smoked that woman until she fucking died, man. Oh, and man. They just like the woman in uh in, 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 in judges, man. Hey, yeah. hey, but that's what it is, and, and it's because of these things. See, you people, you hate us for fuck. It says they hate him and rebuke him and negate, man. That's right. That you hate us for 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 for, for uh, pointing out that this shit is wicked, man. Right. You hate us for, for pointing out uh, the, the right way, man. Right. And, uh, as Scripture says, and uh, Wisdom of Solomon says, uh, the, the, transgre uh, the transgressing of the education, man. Right. We're rebuking you because of the shit that you teach is fucking garbage. It's well, you death. know what, brother? They, they, they push that what is what is good is evil. Mm -hmm. See, I was just thinking about that. They push it. Well, somebody can find it. Go ahead. I, 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 got, I got it. This is uh, back in Jeremiah. Hey, finishing that, brother. Then bring it up. Right, back in Jeremiah 23 and 8. But the Lord Yahweh sent me out with shot and which brought up and which led the seed of the house of Israel out of the north country and from all countries mm -hmm. where I had driven them, and they shall dwell in their own land. That makes it very clear that we got driven into all the countries, every place where there was where, where there, where there were people. Israelites are there. That's right. So, you know, you can't get stuck because we know that Israelites pr primarily make up, you know, Negroes, Latinos, Natives, Haitians, you know, Seminole Indians, you know, Dominicans and that whole sort of thing. But our people are scattered, you know, among the, the people we hate the most. That's right. That's right. That's right. I was watching a, a, a clip of what's my man's name? Uh, Jason Williams. Yeah. That's right. That's White chocolate. Chocolate. They had, yeah, and that's what, they were, and that, that's what the, the little clip was called, White Chocolate. And they had him and a couple of other Edomite-looking guys. And, you know, and I, I really haven't paid you know, attention to basketball since, since the days of Jordan. You know, I was in the fight sport, you know. That's right. I wasn't messing with sports. They had balls and 
That's right. But, uh, <laughs> no, you don't got them hot. But, but nevertheless, man, I started watching these guys because I kind of missed out on that. And I'm like, damn, these dudes, you know, these, these dudes was Jake, man. That's right. Now, ain't, no, ain't no way that they weren't, man. Even Larry Bird. That's yes. right. Yeah. Yeah. That's man. right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's yeah, yeah. Oh, that sweet ball dude, professor. Yeah, the professor. Yeah, professor. White chocolate. I follow him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you, and you already had Jake Paul. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you, and you already had, you already had Israelite scoff in there. You had, you know, uh, what's, this, what's the dude named Chief Ephraim? He said, some of these cats going to be saying he's a Jake. I know they're going to say it. But, you know, you ain't winning no slam dunk contest full of Jake. And not be Jake. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, so there you go, man. It's like, you know, you got a crib ball contest. You think the Edomite might be one that's going to win? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these niggas, y'all not going to convince y'all not going to convince the Israelites. Smart. Y'all not going to convince the Israelites that don't look like Israelites from coming in. And that thing, and that's one thing, that's why I brought it up because brothers going to have to embrace that. Yeah. Of course, you're probably going to have people that are. Uh, that's, you know, you gonna have eight, but you can't fake this. Yep. You can't fake Jake, man. All right? And, and, and anything, and you have to trust in the spirit, man. Luke 8 and 17. All right? Any, anything that's not right will be revealed, man. The spirit will reveal, you know, but you best believe. And, and, and I believe that through the spirit, when, when the shit start hitting the fan completely, all right, which is soon, that's when you're going to start seeing more of them approach. Man. Nah, yeah. Hey, well, uh, like the guy that approached the, uh, the Sakari camp, man. He was, he was supposed to be Irish, and I believe that dude is a jet, man. They, they shut him down because of uh, how he looked. How he looked. I didn't see the video, but, but you know, a lot of these guys are just not spiritual. You know, they don't, you know and, and how many times is scattered and among the heathen in the Bible? Right, Elder Gabar said it perfectly. He said, uh, those that can't see that uh, those Jakes are Israelites, they don't have any vision because it's plain to see that if a man were to have seen after a couple generations, shit, there's second generation Mexicans that look like they got green eyes, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they're light skinned. No, 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 no. Hey, worst example actually, of a good example. I actually put up a list for right check 10 years ago that had red hair and green eyes. That's right. And, and she was she, 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 she had red hair and green eyes, man. So I've never seen a red hair uh, list for right. I've never seen a green eye. Or McGregor. Right. But that chick, was, she was jet, man. 100 right. 100% man. Right, she gave me 32, but you know, it is what it is. I had a Russian chick, man. I had a Russian chick that I was dating years ago, man. And she did me dirty. When she left, she took my uh, Averex jacket, but she was always saying, because they were so called Russian Jews. Hey, so Shabbat, man. Say, uh, hey, Shabbat, Shabbat, y'all talking too much, man. Yeah. It's the pass of a real. Stop fucking talking. And she would say, uh, she said, we're supposed to be black. We're supposed to be black. No, we're Jews. We're supposed to be black. And I never understood it until I came into the truth what she was trying to tell me. Well, the Lord does things like that, man. Yeah, yeah. He puts certain people in your lives and then, you know, later on, and you, yeah. know, you know, I, I remember how, you know, uh, Elder Bar Robert always tell a story about the, the guy he went to school with that was slamming his balls and, you know, basketballs in the eighth grade. Yeah. You know, he, this, 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 some guy he was talking about, man. And you think back, like, damn, that dude was a jet. Mm -hmm. Yep. You know? Yeah, it was Italian guy. Uh, last name of Warren. Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> and he used to dress better, you know, people of human as a white dude, but he had the dress, swag, the huh? swag the of, of Jake, man. Yeah. And when I finally came to the truth and thought back, you know, like, he had to be a Jake. Man. Right. He up there doing 360s in the fucking eighth grade. Yeah, he was doing 360s in the fucking eighth grade. That was Jake. That's, 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 that's the scripture. That was Jake, that's, I was going to say, that's the scripture. I will work a work in your day. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Yahweh of hosts is his name, you know, like, like the brothers was going into. There's certain things that only Jake can do. You know, people like Nikola Tesla, you know, that changed the way we live our life. He came up with that. He's a Jake, but, you know, a lot of these And he makes a bill for free. That's right. He never wanted to charge for That's it. That's right. So, you know, so know that Esau. Tom, you got, you got, uh, you got other nations where they look like other nations in Japan dancing like Jake. That's right. They so-called Memphis Jugging. 
Only yeah. Jay can do that. That's, that's right. That, it's like they floating on fucking. Yeah. yeah. We got a subculture of uh, Chicano. Yeah, they got a Chicano yeah. you know, subculture in in, in uh um, in Japan where they make Mexico. Man, they 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 mimic them L.A. It's correct. Right. Right. You know. Right. They all get and you know what? It's funny because uh, Chicano people in Chicago. I used to work with his wife. His wife that I became friends with him through his wife. When I had that in Poly, some of you brothers remember when I had that in Poly. But, um, yeah. you know, he, he was the only one with, you know, to fix and work on my car. And I used to go by his shop. You know, I'd just be sitting there chilling with him. And that's the that dude. He used to make big money. Because all he used to do was take, he used to go buy used cars, trick them out, put all those hydraulics and all that, all that Iskarite shit on it. And he was and he was sending them over to Japan, man. He was he was spending about five thousand dollars and he turned around and made twenty five thousand. That's right. He was he was selling them cars for thirty, forty grand, man. And them, them, and them rich them, them, them kids over in uh, Japan was buying them shit. That's right. It, hey, other, you know what's crazy? They they're in well gives them up to be Jake. Is they're idolatrous. They still have the Virgin Mary. They don't know why, but they they leave it on there and they'll worship them on the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they'll still have the, the Virgin Mary air freshener and shit. To show why to show their dollars is true because they just follow that shit, not even knowing why. They eat the tacos. They put the Virgin Mary. They put on the fucking sweater with her on it. They're just as idolatrous, which is which is a fucking indicator. They're Jake. And they're crypto. Hey, like the Russian cars. I got a quick one. This is Matthew 5 and 13. Ye are the salt of the earth, but if the salt have lost his savior, wherewith should it be salted? It is, it is therefore good for nothing but to be cast out and to be trudded under foot of men. Because we the salt of the earth. We the one. That's all of these people that Jake talking about. Hey Amen. <laughs> It's, it's no doubt that hey, they Israelites. I, I even had a uh, young young guy that was in my class. I'm like, man, something about you. I didn't know the truth, but I'm like, something about you just don't remind me of no white boy, man. You just too cool, man. Something about you, man. Just like just like uh, you might have a so-called even white hood. They would call them white folk. Uh, uh, oh, white white, 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 white folk. Yeah. White folk. I actually knew you were white folks. Because he was folks and he was white. Right. He was white. Right. We had a white high school. Who is this nigga? We got a white Lord. This nigga look just like Vanilla Ice, man. Hey, Lord, hey, Lord, Russell Czar. Man, Russell Czar. 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 Russell those, those Russian stars, man. It was, it was the, uh, the, the Amalekites that would get rid of those bloodlines. That's right. Yeah. Go ahead, brother. Uh, come on. Uh, speaking about that, uh, I ran to a uh, Sicilian uh, Jake. Uh, he was in uh, Holy Cell one time. And, uh, I had just learned the history about the uh, Moors over Spain. And, uh, we was just talking and shit. And he was like, man, you know, how you know the history? I'm like, I'm just not learning. You know, I'm telling him about the you know, truth and everything. I was just learning myself. Right. And, uh, and it was funny because he was like, yeah, I know my brother not real well. I know um, I go back to the uh, Moors of Spain. So uh, this is, uh, he's like a straight up email, by the way. Yeah, you know, and, then, and then it was crazy because I had a kind of Sicilian woman, too. And she sounded like a straight up God nigga, knows. Nigga, nigga woman. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. good. <laughs> uh, you know, it's real around that part, you know. But uh, this is Ecclesiastes, also known as Sirach 11 2. A man not a man for his beauty, neither a poor man for his outward appearance because uh, I just got out of the trucking school with uh, Ethan Mike. He like straight up Ethan Mike. And uh, he had the blonde hair, he had the blue eyes. And he sounded like Jake in the hood, you know? That's right. So that was kind of, I was like, man, that's straight up. He's straight up Ethan Mike, man. You know, he's whole spirit. You know, he was, I mean, handshake was on point. I mean, everything. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jake, do the same thing. Hey, laugh, but that's yeah, spiritual. It's about Ethan Mike. And we got a uh, Iskrite brother here now who can pass for a so called white man. That's right. Yeah, so, and it ain't joke. Like he holds his hand up. That's right. <laughs> 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 I just got a quick testimony of my mom. Like, she was, you know, she grew up south side. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, just always used to tell me about, you know, how she used to struggle. When she was young, she they didn't have a lot of food to eat, so they would literally grab tortillas. And, you know, they're, they're from, like, Eastern Europe, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, uh, they would uh, throw cheese and all that stuff to make a quesadilla, man. And then when she uh, would... Uh, Go to uh, my brother's school because he went to you know college and all that, uh, U of I and all that. She like thought out a place with the the Edomites that were out there. They used to like 
the other parents used to like basically like, like scoff her. Right. You know, and then a couple of the brothers met my Cause mom. Because our spirit was different. Yeah. yeah. And they, 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 can, they can pick it up, man. I mean, you, hey, look, you can't, you can't, you can't, you know, you can't escape the curses. Right. right. A lot of curses, the curses be on your ass, be on your ass, man. Okay, how fast you can you? You ain't you doing curses. I still got that priest on the call for it. Isaiah 5 and 20. This is Isaiah 5 and 20. Woe unto them that call evil good and good evil. That put darkness for light and light for darkness. That put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Yeah, I know you call it out. Well, you know, this whole, this woman worship and all this back and forth. I got a precept in my back of What he brought up? That was Isaiah, right? Yeah, Isaiah 5. This is the uh, of men. That's why I'm making men. Make it it's right. Family, you right. Know? This is Job 10 and verse uh, starting 19. It says, I should have been as though I had not been. I should have been carried from the womb to the grave. It says, Are not my days few? Cease then and let me alone. And that I may take comfort a little before, and he was prophesying, going into that. It says, before I go whence sh I shall not return, even to the land of darkness and the shadow of death. And that's why King David said, what? Yea, though, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. He was also prophesying about being in this backward-ass society. This is a backward-ass society, man, because uh, somebody, I forget what his brother sent me a clip, but they sent me a clip of uh, gym class in 1960. Uh, versus 2023. Oh, and, 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 and in the clip, it shows you these guys, they were doing pull ups, they were doing rings, they were doing push ups, they were climbing ropes, climbing, jumping on. It looked like they were climbing, turning on the damn bar. Yeah, it looked like bar. Exactly, man. And everybody had six packs, everybody was in shape. Yeah. These were high school kids, man. All right? And then it shows you, you know, then it gave you a clip of, because uh, I got two. First was the, the one by itself, and then I got one where it was stitched. To one of they showed you gym class now. Oh yeah. And the dudes are all in there, you know, doing all that little effeminate dancing thing. So you know, I mean not dancing like you know, like some like some b-boy stuff, but like some, some no, feminine no, shit. No, 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 I know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, I know exactly what video is talking about. So it says it says in verse 21, it says, Before I go whence I shall not return even to the land of darkness and of a shadow of death, a land of darkness. As darkness itself and the shadow of death without any order and where the light is as darkness. Yep. So that there you go. There you go. The light is just darkness, you know. You want to be down with a mo, that's cool, you know. You want to put yourself equal or or, or, or even worse, beneath. beneath a woman, you know, that's fine. You want to eat adultery, you want to commit court, all that's fine. You know, you want to celebrate Easter, Christmas, and Halloween, that's fine. But that's why we out here, man. To denounce the state, the scriptures say we're breaking the strongholds, man. Oh, hey, great, hey, starting with the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, we made the world read the Bible. That's right. right. We brought out the right. real life. That, that's right. That's, that's, right. that's so right. And, 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 you know, whether they got it right or wrong, people are reading the Bible again and people are asking questions. Man. That's right. Even a lot of women, a lot of women are asking questions. Man. That's right. The word right. Edomite is, uh, is being used. Oh, yeah. It's, 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 you know, what did you tell me about like, when you mentioned Edomite and everybody turned around and looked? Yeah. <laughs> you know? Hey, well, it said that that day shall not come except that come a fallen away first and that the man of sin be revealed. <laughs> right. So he saw Edom must yeah. be revealed. And also, you have the prophets that's uh, uh, guiding our, our, uh, the people, which is the elect that's going to uh, adhere to the ways of righteousness. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. the truth is being revealed. Just, just, yeah. just uh, the, 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 the truth coming out and being, being made known and being made specific to Israel, like how Shai said, uh, when he said to the woman by the well, he said, um, you worship, you know not what. With the Baptists, they know they worship, they know not what. The Muslims, they worship, they know not what. All these other uh, nations, they worship, they know not what. For salvation is of the Jews. And that word of is ek. Which means for, all right? That's right. It's for, of, uh, and by, all right? So, 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 uh, this, this is this is part of their their downfall, because the more that we will call upon the power watch me out shy, the more the prophecies are speak out, and and that they are. I mean, that's, it, it, real quick, just like this dude to kill two birds with one stone. We were just talking about guys who look like um, you know, Eve, but they really be Jake. 
It was this dude, Robin Thicke. And we know he a J.M. Oh, yeah. but, but this guy, Nick Cannon, you know, Nick Cannon know who he is, but they was in the room and he said on national TV, he was fucking with him. He was roasting him. He was like, how does he even like get past my security? Yeah. And he said it on just regular feet and now he looked at him like, man, like, <laughs> you can tell he knew but that's what was up. You know and then they had to start smiling and shit like they was in the back of the room just talking about this. Yeah. That's spiritual, man. Yeah, so that, so that, so that lets you know that these celebrities know they've been watching, man. Yeah. All right, we gonna wrap it up. Last two scriptures. Bring it out, brother. Uh, this is Romans 8 and 16. The spirit itself bear witness with our spirit that we are the children of the house. Yeah. So you can't, you can't fake Jake, man. You can't fake Jake. Bring it out your scripture. Uh, so uh, Surah 44 and 19. Abraham was the great father of many people, and glory was there none like unto him, who kept the law of the Most High and was in covenant with them. He established the covenant in his flesh, and when he was proved, he was found faithful. Therefore, he assured him by an oath that he would bless the nations in his seed, and that he would multiply them as the dust of the earth, and exalt his seed as the stars, and cause them to inherit from sea to sea, and from the river unto the utmost part of the land. With Isaac did he establish likewise for Abraham, his father's sake, the blessing of all men, and the covenant, and made it rest upon the head of Jacob. He acknowledged him in his blessing, and gave him inheritance, and divided his portions among the twelve tribes that he parted them. Man, right. that was the perfect, yeah. man, that was the perfect scripture you came Man. That was, that was it. That was it, bro. We're going to wrap it up, man. So, man. with that, we're going to give all praise, all honor, and glory. Yahweh, 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 Yahweh,